The Confederate military government of Arizona was gone from the territory. But the hammer still came down on members of the old provisional government who had not left the territory with the retreating army and rump government. So they were still on the hook for treason. Meanwhile, ex-Confederate Lieutenant Jack Swilling had a very different fate from other Arizona rebels who were getting arrested. Because he deserted from the Confederate Army to avoid being disciplined for stopping fellow troops from looting civilian homes on its retreat from Mesilla to El Paso, he gambled on staying behind and surrendering to the Federals. Swilling promptly switched sides once the Yankees arrived in Mesilla, and he even got a civilian job with the Federal Army as a mail carrier. Presumably, he surrendered, gave the Federals all the intelligence he knew, and took the Union loyalty oath in exchange for parole. Still, it's incredible that the Federals gave this recent rebel officer a job with the U.S. Army. 